Hey, how's it going? Today I'll show you the easy way how you can download BTV to your Fire Stick or Android TV. The whole process is super easy and will take you only a couple of minutes. First of all, you have to get an app called Unloader. You can get it for free from the official Amazon App Store or from Google Play Store, depending of course on your device. So just go to search and here in the search bar, start typing the loader. Usually, as you can see, there is even no need to enter the whole name of the app because the loader already popped out for us. So we click on the loader and that's the app which you need to get to your device. However, after you get the loader, it's not over yet. We still have to set it up. And to set up the loader, we gotta go to settings. Here they are, let's open them and then go to My Fire TV. Open it. Here we'll have to enable developer options on your device. However, on some Fire Sticks, and especially on the new ones, the developer options might be hidden by default. So if that's the case, don't worry, it's really easy to make them appear. In that case, we go to About, select Fire TV Stick, and now you have to click on the middle button on your remote for seven times, and do it fast. So let's do it. As you can see, now the bottom it says no need, you are already a developer. That's in my case. In your case, it's going to say that you have become a developer now. And if you go back a bit, you will finally see developer options, which have appeared right here. So open them, make sure to enable ADB debugging, then go to install unknown apps. And in here, turn that option on for the loader. So what it does, it's going to allow us to install other applications from the internet, and not necessarily only from official Amazon App Store. And therefore, that's exactly what we're going to do right now. So now let's go to the list of apps on your device. Here it is, let's open it. And there is the loader application, which we just installed. However, before actually using the loader, you definitely should use a VPN first. In my case, I mostly use NordVPN. Because they're super fast, they got a great application for Fire Sticks, Android TVs, or any other device that you have, and of course they cost less than a cup of coffee per month, which is also a great factor for choosing NordVPN. In the VPN app, you just connect to any server, and from the moment you connect, you are going to be totally encrypting your internet traffic. It means nobody can track you or snoop on you online. And that's extremely important if you wish to stay out of trouble. And if you don't have a VPN yet, but you'd like to try it out, I do have a great offer for you. If you use my link, which will be in a pinned comment below the video, you'll get 4 months of NordVPN totally for free, which is an amazing offer. So go get those 4 months for free and then use the loader safely. And now we can finally go and open the downloader application. Here on the left side menu, make sure to click on home, that's really important. So select home here and there you'll see a search bar which has appeared for us. Let's open it and then we'll need to enter a code which is going to be 2, 8, 9, 0 and 7. So the code is 28907 and then click on go. And now, in a couple of seconds, a website is going to open for us. And here it is, the website has opened, but we also have to scroll down a little bit until we see a list of categories. And here it is, here are the categories, and there we need to find movies and TV. That's the category we have to click on. Then, after a click, a huge list of apps is going to open for you, and there's the BTV which we are looking for. So let's click on BTV. After that, most likely you see some ad, and there you definitely should not click open, instead click close or click on the X, depending on what kind of ad you see, because if you click on open, it's going to mess everything up for you. So click on close. After that, a new web page is going to open for you, which you also have to scroll down. And we keep scrolling until we see those download buttons. As you can see, there is ad free version as well as usual version of BTV. Also, if those buttons do not work for you and the app does not download, you can always use backup download links, which are just below the usual download buttons. So for now, we just click on the usual download button and in a couple of moments, the app is going to be downloading to your device. As you can see, that happens really fast. Here, click on install in the right bottom corner. And now, after the app has been installed, do not press on open yet. Instead, click on done. And here we'll have an option to delete the installation file, as we don't need anymore. So click on delete, and then delete once again. Now we have erased the unnecessary installation file. Now let's finally go to the list of apps on your device. So here it is, let's open it. 
Then scroll down and at the bottom you'll find BTV which we just installed to your Fire Stick. I recommend you to click on the Options button on your remote, that's the bottom of three horizontal lines and then press on Move to Front. This way the application is always going to be at the very top of your application list and it's going to be easier for you to access BTV every time you need it. And of course don't forget to get a VPN to stay out of trouble online. A link to a great offer for NordVPN is going to be in the pinned comment below the video. Thank you for watching and see you next time. Bye bye.